So hey y'all, welcome to my channel. This is Uniquely Made Jessica and this is a channel mostly dedicated to any and everything on a budget. So whether that's beauty, lifestyle, fashion, the whole shebang. If you want to find it cheap, I mean, I could try my best to find it. So if this is the kind of content that you're into, like, rate, subscribe. And today, I'm going to put you on how I get all my freebies. Whether that's perfume, samples, makeup, snacks, the whole thing. So if you want to see how I do it, please stay tuned. So you might notice in a few of like my empties videos and things like that, I do be having empties of like different samples and sometimes full size products that I get for free. And I'm pretty sure y'all might want to know how I get them so you can save your little coin or try different things without actually having to pay for it. So. I'm gonna let you know how I do it. And I got everything written down on this legal pad, so I won't forget. So if you see me looking down, that's why. So the first place where I get the um, free samples is through this site called SoPost. S-O-P-O-S-T, SoPost. So pretty much, you can sign up for it, or I'm gonna get into this later. They will have forms on your social media sites you can sign up just use like the email address and whatever your name tell me your address and it will send you different products in the mail so yeah it'll take me like a couple of weeks maybe at the most about a month or so and then when you get enough time to actually test the product they will normally send you an email and it's asking like a few a few basic questions like what did you like about it? What didn't you like about it? Some is like multiple choice so you could choose like on a scale how you like certain products. And then you just put your demographics and go from there. And I'll probably insert pictures and or videos on the side of what kind of free um, things I received in the mail. I don't know which ones I've received stuff from SoPost, but it's mostly like through like different forms I built out. And the second thing is Pop Sugar Dabble. So you sign up for Pop Sugar Dabble, and pretty much they will send you an email pretty much saying, hey, I think you might want, let's just say, a free sample of perfume. You sign up for it, you get approved, they send it out to you. I think you still have to review it too, but it's not like you have to post on social media. And oh yeah. Some of these you do have to like post a review or something on social media and other ones you don't. So keep that in mind whether you just like posting certain things on social media or you just want stuff and go about your business. The third thing I have is Influencer. And this is the one I've been doing the longest. So I signed up with Influencer back in 2013-2014. So pretty much the gist of it, they have a website and they also have an app. So you just kind of interact with the site or with the app, answer different questions, do reviews, things of that nature. And their boxes is called a box box. So you will probably get a physical box or a, a digital one. And sometimes with the digital ones, you get cash back rewards for it. Like you buy something, then give you the cash back for what you purchased on the item. And while I, I don't really do the digital ones, I prefer getting the actual boxes. So pretty much how it works, it's like they'll send you a survey on the app or you do it online through the email or whatever. You answer the questions to the best of your abilities, always be honest. And if you fit the qualifications, they'll send you a box box. You test the product out and they have like different steps you have to do. So let's just say, I just did one. I just finished one for the Lady Gaga House Labs Foundation Translucent Powder and it also came with a foundation brush. So pretty much with that one, what I had to do, and the campaign normally runs for like a month or so, so it give you enough time to test the product. So pretty much it asked me to post it on Instagram which I did, then it will probably ask you to review it on Sephora for that particular one it did, and then it will probably ask you to review it on the influencer website. 
once you do whatever they ask you to do, you get a badge. And also with Influencer, you have to finish the post survey every time. Because if you don't, you won't get any more boxes. So please keep that in mind. But I've gotten makeup. I've gotten like a Victoria's Secret sports bra, jogging pants, perfume samples, food, pods, things of that nature. I've received a lot of things from working with Influencer. And I actually just got... Another one for like a leave-in conditioner or something like that, or rinse-out conditioner. So, I'm going to have to um, test that out, see how it works as well. And it also puts you on to different products that you probably never would have tried before. So, that's Influencer. The next thing I have is Skeepers. And I think Skeepers um, is formerly, it got together with Octoly. So, it's formerly known as Octoly. Is now called Skeepers. They just changed it like a couple weeks ago. So, pretty much, you get on the site, and I ain't gonna lie, but Octoly, I don't always have the best look. I only got something from them once, and I tried the Dermalogica Daily Micro Exfoliant. I think that's what it's called, and it gives you like the little packets. Anyway, you could go on there, connect it to your social media, and I guess if you have enough of a following, you can do it as like an influencer. I'm not there yet. So you can do it as like a consumer. The only thing that annoys me about Skeepers, aka Octoly, you go, because I have an Android, so when I go on the Octoly app, so it still works, you go on the Octoly app, it will transfer you to like the website, which, okay, whatever. But it's like once I get on there, it's like, Everything is gone. I'm not able to test it with anything. And that's been like that for me for the past two or three months or so. So, I wouldn't necessarily rely on Skeepers, aka Opley, unless they fix their platform. And I've even turned on my notifications, but not much luck. So, take with that with a grain of salt. The next one I have is Pinch Me. And this is another one. You get free samples, but for me personally, I've had issues with them. Not like they did anything wrong, per se. I've only gotten like one product from Pinch Me, but for some reason, every time I try to log in, it would not let me log in, even when I change my password and stuff. So, I don't know what's up with that, but that's another site. You sign up and whatever, and if you qualify to receive certain products, you get the free product. And you don't have to post, like, on social media. You probably still have to do, like, a small review where they send you, like, an email or something. But it's not like, oh, I got to post on my YouTube, my TikTok, or my Instagram. So, that's that. The next one is Buzz Agent. And I just received something from Buzz Agent. And they just got a brand new platform. So, it's a new platform. So, if you want to try them out, try them out. So, pretty much... You sign up, and if they feel like you might be a good fit for a campaign, they will email you. You answer the questions. And this is another one you don't necessarily have to post everything on your social media. So, I just received a Lancome foundation, and soon I'll be receiving the matching concealer. So pretty much, you might not have to post on social media. Sometimes you do, but I don't think I have to with this one. You test the product out. They'll send you another email. You let them know how you like the product and go on about your business. So I like that one as well. And I've also received the oil from Commit Biologics through Buzz Agent. So I think I like them. If you compare that one to like Pinch Me, I like buzz agent a little bit better. I feel like pinch me got some things it needs to work out. The next one is pretty much you can get free samples on Facebook through Facebook and Instagram. So pretty much I might post a screenshot over here over here. So pretty much this is how you should do it. So I would say like different like pages such as Macy's, Bloomingdale's, Gucci, 
you know, things like that. Brands that sell like perfume, designer stuff, skincare, the whole thing. So pretty much once you do that and you interact with those pages, you will see little forms popping up on your Instagram or on your Facebook. And you fill that form out, you will literally get like sample sizes. You might get a full size, but most of the stuff I received is sample sizes. You test it out, then they'll just send you an email asking a few questions and that's that. I just got something in the mail today, actually. And it was from Macy's. You get complimentary fragrance samples. And I know that helps me a lot because I'm, you know, still learning my thing with perfumes and stuff. And I don't want to spend hundreds of dollars on perfume and I don't know if I like it. So that comes in a clutch. And most of those are mostly through so post also so if you don't have to sign up for an account with so post because a lot of those are actually through so post so that's that another way you could get free samples things of that nature but sometimes you have to actually purchase something so you don't necessarily have to do this one but if you go to like sephora or something like that or any company that sells like perfume, skincare, stuff like that, you might actually get free samples along with your order. Like perfume, skincare, whatever the case may be. So that's another way, but with that you might actually have to pay for something, which if you don't want to do it, I get it. Um, the last one I have is ProductSamples.com. I don't know if I really got anything from ProductSamples.com for real, but I did sign up for them, so... It works just like so post and whatever you get the product you test it out and you go from there and I've re like I said, I've received a lot of things I've received um let me show y'all real quick so hey y'all I'm back so I'm gonna show you a few of the free things I received from these sites and I received like I said I received this Lancome foundation from Buzz Agent. So this is the tank, the tank I doll ultra wear carrying glow foundation and that sunscreen. And I haven't tested it out yet, but I will. I'm waiting on the concealer to get here. The next thing I got from my influencer is this house last foundation, which I mentioned earlier. I just finished the campaign for this one and I got a badge. So on top of just getting samples, sometimes you do receive full size products. And then as you can see, I also got perfume samples. I got these two probably from like Macy's or something like that. And I think I received a Bloomingdale's little freebie bag. This is, you know, Killian Love Don't Be Shy. I received this when I ordered from the Spring Sephora sale. So yeah getting freebies saves you money it helps you to not spend unnecessary money on things that you don't even know that you would like or don't like so yeah that's pretty much it for this video if you see me in the shirt again in another video i guess it's crazy for me to record at 10 something at night before i have to go to bed but that's pretty much about it. Like I said, I'm going to have screenshots <clears throat> on the side while you're watching the video. And I will post, I will probably post the links in the description box. Just so y'all have access to them. And that's pretty much it. If you like this video, like, rate, and subscribe. And until next time, bye.